Hello! And welcome to our weekly CSA unboxing video. It is week 10 of the 2021 season. It is the last Friday in August. And I know that because yesterday was the last Thursday. And the last Thursday of the month is when they pick up the brush here oh. in Canton. So, and I got my brush out at the right time. So nice. that's how I know it's the last week, last Friday. Tomorrow will be the last Saturday. Thank you. I, I'm really glad I came on the show. <laughs> <laughs> and it goes on in, okay. this, in a sequence okay. like that. Anyway, with me is uh, Ellis Giacomelli, our uh, reporter out of uh, covering Canton and um, other stuff, environmental issues and uh, things like that there. And uh, this is her second visit to the it CSA is. unboxing video. Two Timers Club. The Two Timers Club. And last time you challenged me to use all the ingredients in one dish and and I didn't do it. <laughs> and I was going, my idea, my big idea was I was going to make an omelet. Okay. Because you could do, you know, you could put a piece of kale, you could like put a piece of anything in an yeah. omelet. And um, the idea that counts. Yeah. And I just didn't do, I did, you know, I, I nobody else. Uh, eats omelets in the house but me okay. and that would have to be a big omelet sure. and I'd be eating it for a week and I don't have that much sriracha ketchup all right. Your okay. excuse. <laughs> excuse. so we'll have to come up with something different today all right. all right here we go let's take a look at the uh, trip to the farmers market today and photos I took around the house of us not preparing any food because it was too hot to cook this delighted the eighth grade boy who lives in my head there's the big board with all the choices. Like these tomatoes, don't they look nice? And these potatoes, they look nice too. And everyone likes an eggplant. I cook some corn on the grill. And we're back and you can tell that because I'm sitting here and you can see me. We didn't really go anywhere. <laughs> no. no. Okay, but we are here. We're all right. Let's see. Let's start with with something new. We haven't um, we Ooh. haven't had these yet this year. Something new. And it is potatoes. Potatoes. So how do you like nice. your potatoes? Um. Anyway, really. You're from Erie, Pennsylvania. I am. Do they eat salt potatoes in Erie, Pennsylvania? Um, I'm sure they do. That wasn't necessarily a staple in my family, okay. but... It's yeah. like a Syracuse treat in oh, New York. Okay. You can buy a bag of salt potatoes. It comes with salt. Okay. You boil it. Um, it always seems excessive to me. It always seems like too much salt. Yeah. No. <laughs> Let's see. Can you juggle? Can, you juggle? <laughs> can I juggle potatoes for a little bit? <laughs> there, okay. So, juggle potatoes. Um, yeah, I like potatoes any which way. Don't, but don't eat a lot just because, uh... I think we talked about this last year uh, because I think of potatoes, I think of baked potatoes, I think of sticking them in the oven and waiting an hour when we actually have a, a potato button on our microwave. So. Right, right. Um, this is the cutest thing I've got today. Oh, oh, the little hairs on the top of this tomato's head. Yeah. Too darn cute. Looks like a cartoon character. It really does. Looks, what is the Veggie Tales? Larry? Oh, yeah. I think. Is Larry the. I don't no, know the names. No, no. Larry the cucumber or the tomato? Oh, no. I don't know. Mine go back. Oh, look at this cute <gasps> tomato to go oh. with it. Or potato. What a You pear. say potato. I say tomato. Because tomato. Nice. nobody says tomato. Yeah. <laughs> or <laughs> And definitely nobody says potato. Oh, absolutely not. Uh, my aunt in Syracuse used to say potato. I'm sorry to say it, but I <laughs> don't like your aunt. Oh, <laughs> uh, don't worry. She's... <laughs> All right, that's the other uh, tomato. Nice. It was a pound of tomatoes, I think, and so I got the little one to nice. make up the difference. I might have gone a little over. Um, <laughs> oh, that's a big one. One big green pepper, isn't that good looking? This is beautiful. You could get so you could like just cut a little piece off each time you want to use it, and then it could last you for a long time. Yep, several days. Yeah. Put pepper in just about everything mm -hmm. for some reason. Um, Nice. More carrots. I think, yeah, you were here when we had the weird carrots and I made the, uh -huh. the diorama. Um, the thing I like about these, we got a lot of carrots. They grow a lot of carrots at Kent Family Growers. And, um, and they are available pretty much year-round. Mm. You can buy them, uh, I know, at Nature Storehouse. 
right to the bitter end of winter. From Kent at yeah. Nature's? Okay. There's another potato. Nice. Keep adding that. And, of course, nice corn. sweet corn. We don't have a sweet corn button on our microwave, <laughs> but that's how we cook our corn now, is in the microwave. I bet you have a popcorn button on your microwave. I don't know, because I make my popcorn on the stovetop okay. as intended. Yeah. I was camping this weekend and I made popcorn over the fire. That is just a little. Did you do it with I Jiffy like Pop? Um, no, it was <laughs> just loose kernels. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's all, what I do. Yeah. I actually have a Whirly Pop. Oh. Uh, maker that I got for my birthday once nice. by the Franklin Popcorn Company oh. and the top I used it so much the top broke uh -huh. and I called them up and they said it's guaranteed for life and they sent me a new one nice new top not a new pan <laughs> because I've got the pan all season uh -huh. never been washed <laughs> um, so those are my I have four kinds of squashes no three kinds of squashes you could take four squashes Ooh. so I got that don't I don't know what that is that's a UFO squash Yep. Unidentified <laughs> frying object. Nice. A summer squash, sometimes those are called. And these are, of course, the zucchinis. Zucchinis. Um, I didn't get lettuce this week Ugh. because I, I still have some I still have some lettuce left in the refrigerator. Okay. Um, and I didn't uh, get kale because. Oh right. She's out of town. Yeah. And she told me not to get kale. Okay. So I got more onions because we got that pepper and they go together mm -hmm. like onions and peppers onions and peppers or like tomatoes and potatoes yeah and the last thing this is one of my favorite things from last year and this is the first time we've got it this year so two new things this week potatoes, potatoes and a little watermelon oh what a treat i know so the um the, tr the thing of this is like uh lucy's at work right now and she won't be back until late tonight mm -hmm. so who knows if she will know that we had watermelon in the house because it might be gone no i would never do that <laughs> i would never do that because she watches this and then she would know mm -hmm. actually she doesn't watch this and like unless i make her sit down and watch I guess, it with yeah me. so this would be a test to see right. if she does watch it no she doesn't okay she even when she watches it with me i have to keep saying L -l 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 you have to watch because i put these funny things the writing <laughs> and she doesn't anyway so that <laughs> that's what we got here uh at the uh csa unboxing video clubhouse uh we'll be back next week for week 11 the first friday in september always celebrated as something first friday in yeah september? And the first monday in september is labor day right okay so the first friday is back to two-day weekends 